Rachel White with the Horizon League here with Raina Osterhase from Cleveland State Women's Golf. Raina, first, just kind of what have you been up to and how you've been doing during these last couple months? Yeah, I mean, I've been good. Um, it's kind of been a whirlwind with graduating and getting schoolwork and trying to figure out what my next step is. But I've um, been watching Netflix, uh, also trying to get my schoolwork done and get everything else done. And it's just staying in contact with my family um, that's back in Canada as well. And how have you been able to stay in touch with not only your family, but obviously some of your teammates who you're, you're normally accustomed to being a little closer to? Yeah, luckily, um, obviously technology is here for us. So FaceTime, Zoom calls, uh, lots of my friends and teammates, uh, we kind of set up game nights on Zoom and we're playing Cards Against Humanity and different types of games like that. So that's really fun to kind of, I guess, hang out in a different sense that we normally wouldn't. Awesome. And obviously you're a golfer, so why golf? Uh, what do you love about it? Uh, so I grew up playing a bunch of sports. Uh, I grew up playing hockey and volleyball um, really competitively when I started golfing. And golf was kind of just something I picked up during the summer to kind of do something else other than train. And I think the aspect of just how like frustrating it was to me that it was like I could be so good, but then you hit like a terrible shot and you're like, how did I just hit a good one and then a bad one? So it was just the aspect of like, I wanted to like master the craft and like, I guess my competitive spirit is like, be the best I can. That's awesome. And you kind of mentioned it's like such a mental game. So kind of what different things sort of run through your mind as you're trying to finish a round? Gosh, depends on the day, honestly. Um, I think the fact that you are about to finish the round, I mean, it depends if you're playing well or you're playing bad, but especially in college golf I think having like your teammates at the end of like like that 18th hole kind of waiting for you or knowing like you know I have to par out or birdie out or whatever I have to do just to like kind of have my teammates back so I think that's like a big thing for me is just as a team like make golf a team sport. So um, what does it mean to you that you've been able to be a student as well as an athlete in college? Yeah um, it's definitely a dream come true there's a lot of different uh, things that you have to kind of do as a student athlete uh, and learn, I guess, is definitely the biggest one is time management and just making sure you're organized and have everything together. Um, because if you're not, you're going to forget something. Uh, so I think just like life skills has definitely been probably the biggest thing I've learned as being a student athlete. Um, and then the people you meet are phenomenal and lifelong friends. That's great. And one of the things you've had an opportunity to do is to be on the Horizon League SAC and also be the student athlete representative on our resources cabinet. So what have you kind of learned or maybe taken away from that experience? Yeah, um, I'm a business major. So it's kind of been really cool in the aspect that it's collided like the sports world and the business world, um, like the finance. Uh, so on the resource cabinet, we deal a lot with the budget. So just kind of seeing those two worlds collide is probably really is one of the coolest things and just like knowing like they, what they're talking about on the calls and being like oh yeah I learned that in class is like really cool. That's great and obviously you mentioned it before that you're a senior so what do you kind of hope is next for you even if you don't know kind of what are you hoping to do next? Um I get asked this question like no other now I feel like it's the only thing people ask me nowadays but honestly I don't know um, I just kind of taking it day by day and what opportunities present themselves, especially with COVID-19. Everyone's kind of going crazy. They don't know what's happening and when things are going to pick up, if they're going to pick up. So it's kind of hard to, I guess, have a set answer in that situation because I really don't know. Um, but hopefully uh, get a job and move on and be successful in another area. Yeah, absolutely. And is there something like maybe there's a place or just a thing that you can't do right now with everything going on that you're looking forward to doing when things are a bit more normal? Um, golf, honestly, just golfing every day uh, is something I think I took for granted. Uh, I don't even have my golf clubs right now. They're actually still in our locker room and I haven't been able to get them. So I've been itching to get out there and play golf, uh, especially now the weather's getting nice. It's kind of making it really difficult now. For sure. Okay, now we're going to just move into some kind of more fun getting to know you questions. So I'll just ask you about some of your favorite things. 
feel free to elaborate on your answer or not. Just kind of depends on what you think. Right. So we'll start with what is your favorite social media platform? Ooh, I think maybe Snapchat or TikTok. I like watching the funny videos. Not really, the, I'm not into the dance videos, but the funny videos on TikTok I like. Gotcha. Do you have a favorite movie? Wolf of Wall Street. Favorite pizza topping? I am not a picky eater at all, so literally anything, including pineapple, but I guess if I had to pick um, pepperoni, which I feel like is really basic, but we'll go with that. Do you have a favorite superhero? I grew up watching Batman, so maybe Batman, but uh, I like The Incredibles too. I don't know if they count as a superhero, but they're yeah. pretty cool. Awesome. Um, what's your go-to kind of uh, pre-round music? Uh, anything like rap, hip hop, or like something with a really catchy chorus, just so I kind of have that stuck in my head as I'm playing like the golf round. Uh, that's kind of one of the funniest things that I think happen in golf is you'll randomly have a song that you're singing and you listen to it like four days ago and you're like, how is this even happening? But that's awesome. Favorite TV show to binge watch? Prison Break, hands down, phenomenal show. Okay. Do you have any hidden talents? No, <laughs> not at all. <laughs> okay, last one. I know this might be difficult for you. You said you're not a picky eater, but do you have a favorite food? Um, I love a good steak. Great answer. Well, thank you so much, Raina, for taking a few minutes to chat with us and hope you're doing well and best of luck figuring out what's next for you. Yeah, thank you so much.